Major showdown now on the books. The time and place for the first presidential debate set and it's going to be right here in Atlanta. President Joe Biden and former President Donald Trump will go head to head on CNN on June 27th. They also accepted ABC's invitation for a second debate on September 10th. And this comes after Biden pulled out of the traditional debate set up by the Commission on Presidential Debates and challenged Trump to face him on the news networks. Make my day, pal. I'll even do it twice. So let's pick the dates, Donald. Former President Donald Trump responded on Truth Social, stating in part that it was a, quote, great honor to accept the CNN debate against Joe Biden. So some very big news today. We want to get straight to 11 Alive's Doug Richards, a member of our political team here. Doug, you're live in downtown Atlanta. And what are Republicans and Democrats saying about this debate tonight? Well, they would love for it to help influence voters uh, their way. It would be a stretch, however, really to say that the location of a debate would influence voters specifically uh, in that state. That said, both camps clearly need Georgia in order to win uh, the Electoral College in November. And so uh, both candidates, Biden and Trump, uh, will get a chance to make their case from a stage in Atlanta in June. I'm the least racist person in this room. Come on. This guy is a dog whistle about as big as a foghorn. When Joe Biden and Donald Trump shared a stage nearly four years ago, there was a lot of heat and a close election that followed. Now the two candidates have agreed to meet again in a state Trump won in 2016 and Biden won in 2020. Republican Sally Grubbs says the location makes sense to both campaigns. And I think that this debate being located in Atlanta, that it just reinforces the fact that um, the road to the White House goes through Georgia and people know that. I believe that this is a state that both sides desperately need to, uh, to build the electoral votes to have a victory in November. Democrat Michael Bond, an Atlanta City Councilman, says the timing of the debate four months before Election Day can help dislodge some potential voters who may be unexcited about the projected Trump-Biden rematch. Because every vote is going to matter. Uh, in this camp. It matters anyway, but in particular, those who have the ability to influence the outcome, those who are undecided, that small margin is what's going to make the difference. Grubbs says activists in Georgia can use the debate to hone their messaging to drive up turnout. I think it's a So the uh, June debate will certainly uh, precede the two national conventions that will take place this summer. Uh, it will precede all the lovely advertising that uh, voters here can expect to see between now and November, but it will certainly give voters an opportunity to sort of shape their frame of reference uh, going into all those events as the saturation uh, begins later this year. We are live downtown. Back to you. It's something a lot of people have been waiting for, Doug. Thank you so much.